In a significant move to enhance defense cooperation, the defense ministers of Japan, the United Kingdom, and Italy have agreed to expedite the joint development of a next-generation fighter jet as part of the Global Combat Air Program, GCAP. This strategic initiative is a direct response to the escalating threats posed by nations such as China, Russia, and North Korea. The agreement was reached during a trilateral meeting held at the G7 Defense Minister Summit in Naples, Italy. Launched in 2022, the GCAP aims to produce a next-generation stealth fighter jet that is slated for deployment by 2035. This new aircraft will replace Japan's F-2s, which were developed in collaboration with the United States, as well as the Eurofighter Typhoons, a product of cooperation among the UK, Italy, Spain, and Germany. This trilateral project not only reflects the intent of the three nations to bolster their defense capabilities, but also highlights their commitment to advancing cutting-edge technology to address international security challenges. The GCAP represents a major international collaboration, bringing together the governments of the UK, Italy, and Japan alongside key defense industry players, including BAE Systems, UK, Leonardo Italy, and Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, Japan. The future combat aircraft is expected to be among the most advanced globally, featuring intelligent weapon systems, a software-driven interactive cockpit, integrated sensors, and next-generation radar technology capable of processing 10,000 times more data than current systems, thereby providing a critical battlefield advantage. This program is not only a technological advancement, but also a crucial initiative for the security and economic prosperity of the three partner nations. GCAP promotes knowledge and technology transfer while allowing each country to maintain sovereignty over its aerial defense capabilities. Substantial investments and robust cooperation between governments and industries are anticipated to yield significant economic benefits and ensure the long-term development of essential industrial skills. During the recent meeting, Japan's Defense Minister Gen Nakatani, alongside his UK and Italian counterparts, John Healy and Guido Crosetto, announced the establishment of a trilateral government organization to oversee the aircraft's development. This new body, named the GCAP International Government Organization GAIGO, will be officially launched by the end of the year and will be based in the UK under Japanese leadership. Its primary function will be to facilitate collaboration between Japanese, British, and Italian companies involved in the project. Private sector companies, including Mitsubishi Heavy Industries from Japan, BA Systems PLC from the UK, and Leonardo from Italy, will play central roles in the design and production of the aircraft. A notable milestone was achieved at the Tokyo International Aerospace Exhibition, where a one-tenth scale model of the future aircraft was showcased for the first time, illustrating the collective efforts of the three nations to integrate their expertise and technology into this next-generation fighter jet. Minister Nakatani expressed optimism regarding the project's trajectory, stating that the establishment of GAIGO and a joint venture could lead to the signing of the first contract as early as next year. This development signifies substantial progress, despite concerns stemming from recent leadership changes in Japan and the UK. Akira Sugimoto, the principal representative for Mitsubishi Heavy Industries within the GCAP program, emphasized the project's significance for Japanese suppliers and the national defense industry. He noted that the development of this joint fighter jet provides a valuable opportunity for Japanese companies to demonstrate their technological prowess and contribute to producing a high-quality aircraft. Sugimoto added that this initiative could also enhance the capabilities of Japanese suppliers in developing equipment and improve their competitiveness within the defense sector. As Japan rapidly strengthens its military capabilities in response to China's growing influence in the region, the GCAP initiative stands as a pivotal step forward. It not only aims to fortify Japan's defense industry, which has historically faced limitations in its development, but also aligns with Tokyo's broader strategy of supporting global security efforts. By relaxing its arms export restrictions, Japan is now positioned to sell this advanced fighter jet abroad and licensed domestic equipment, such as the PAC-3 interceptors. Additionally, this move complements Tokyo's commitment to support Ukraine by replenishing depleted U.S. weapons stockpiles following American aid to Kiev. Through this collaborative endeavor, Japan, the UK, and Italy are not just creating a next-generation fighter jet, they are also reinforcing a united front against emerging global threats, ensuring their nations are well-equipped for the challenges ahead.